Holmes under the Hammer presenter Martin Roberts has updated fans after he was rushed to hospital with hours to live before undergoing emergency surgery. Holmes under the Hammer presenter Martin Roberts, 58, has issued an update after being rushed to hospital with chest pains, leading to emergency surgery to save his life. The star explained fluid had gathered around his heart and he was close to death, but was now recovering. Martin explained in a video for his Twitter followers that the incident had been a bit of a shocker. Sitting in a hospital ward, Martin showed he was watching Holmes under the hammer on the screen in his room. Well, I have to say this isn't where I expected to be watching Holmes under the hammer, he said. Little bit of good news, little bit of bad news. I ended up in hospital in bath yesterday, I had a few chest pains and just feeling generally lousy. So I was brought in here and turns out I had a massive amount of fluid all around my heart, which was actually stopping my heart working. Had they not got rid of it, which they did in an emergency operation last night, then it's sort of quite serious, like, hours to live kind of see asterisk. So here I am, still around, thank goodness, thank God and angels, all those things. Martin continued, there's lots of other complicated things that have happened as a result, but we will work through those. And I'll keep you updated. Meanwhile, there's a good TV show on that I think I'll watch here, he joked. His co-star Lucy Alexander rushed to show her support, replying, OMG, OMG, sending you the biggest hug ever. Love ya mate X. Leslie Bowman wrote, Oh my goodness. Get well soon. I know how you feel, as I was admitted to hospital when critically ill last year, but of course the NHS are wonderful as we well know. Martin's hospital dash comes weeks after his selfless mission to deliver supplies to Ukrainian refugees on the border. The property expert made the 22-hour journey as part of a charity convoy as Russia invaded the country, sparking a refugee crisis. He was seen breaking down in tears at one point while gathering the supplies, as he was told he couldn't buy the quantity of Calpol he needed at Costco due to limitations on medicine purchases. Martin begged supervisors to make an exception but said they refused, but thankfully other shoppers stepped in to help, putting the cowpaw in their own baskets so he could take the necessary quantity to Ukraine. 